Good morning, warriors of God. Derek Lee, I will pray for America. John chapter 15, verse number 7 reads as thus. If you remain in me, this is Jesus speaking. If you remain in me and my words remain in you, ask whatever you wish and it will be done for you. You know why? Because the branch cannot survive without remaining in the vine. And Jesus is the vine. We are the branches. Let's pray for America. Father, in Jesus' name, by the power and the blood of the one true living God, the first begotten son from the dead, in the mighty name of Jesus, who has now seated in heavenly places and has placed us in that position of authority. Father God, we come lifting up the United States of America into your hands today. May we, the people, remain in you. May we, the people, abide in you, God. And as we abide in you, we come asking for this nation that you will vindicate us, O oh God, from the hand of evil. You will vindicate God families across this country who have suffered at the hand of wicked men and women. Father God, you will vindicate the children, vindicate your church. You will vindicate the White House. You will vindicate the Supreme Court. You will vindicate, oh God, the Capitol building. You will vindicate every agencies across the government. Father God, in the name of Jesus, where righteousness is exalted, righteousness should be vindicated. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, on today, you will vindicate the United States military, Father God. And where there is evil and wickedness, Father God, in the name of Jesus, it shall all be dissolved and righteousness shall exalt this country from coast to coast and from sea to shiny sea. Why? Because in, in America, in God we trust. <laughs> in America, Jesus Christ is Lord. And because we are one nation under God, indivisible with liberty, justice, freedom for all. In the name of God, the Father, Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, and the Ruach HaKadosh, the breath of God, I cover this lamb with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. And I thank you, God, that where the blood is applied, the enemy is not welcome. In Yeshua HaMashiach's name, I pray today. In Jesus' name, amen. Warriors of God, you know what to do. Have a fabulous, blessed day. Know this one thing, no devil in hell can touch us because of the power of the cross, because he's given his angels charge over us because we are surrounded by a wall of fire and because of the blood of Jesus Christ. And when the enemy sees the blood, he has to skip us and pass over us. And on that note, devil has nothing on us. Until the next time, warriors, take care. Bye-bye.